Top 10 Fusion Nodes Today's video is sponsored by Adobe. The first and most important node is the Merge node. This node works basically like new layers on top of your clip. Every time you want to add something, you are going to use the Merge node. The background node, I guess is self-explanatory. You can use it to create a solid color, or you can change the type to add more colors and gradients. Usually I'm combining the background node with a mask node, which brings us to the next node. Polygon mask is one of the mask nodes that is very useful. You can use it on the background node to create your desired shape, or you can use it as a mask for any other node by connecting it to the blue point of the node. The transform node is also self-explanatory. Every time you want to transform something you need to use this node. Unfortunately you can't use this node to transform your girlfriend. Displace node is a great node to experiment with. It's pretty simple, it will displace your clip based on a reference image. In order for this to work, you need to connect an image to the green point of the node, which brings us to the next one again. The fast noise node is what exactly the name says. You can create a noise pattern and animate it. Most of the times I'm combining this with the displace node. This is my most used node. Very easy to use and pretty useful. Not many things to say here, you just need to experiment with it. Every time that your computer is dying, you can use the saver node and select to render all saver nodes. Bring the loader node into the flow and now your playback will be smooth. Use the luma key to isolate parts of your image based on the luminance. This is not a green screen replacer. Usually I'm adding the luma key to target my effect into a specific part of the image. Most of the times it's just random, but I like to pretend that it was exactly what I wanted. Last but not least, the planar tracker. Way better than the normal tracker in Fusion, worth to spend some time experimenting with the tracker settings.